Hello, my, good afternoon, my name is James. I'm in the uh, Blackpool Art Gallery today on Church Street in Blackpool, uh, visiting William Cummings, he's the resident artist in Blackpool Art Gallery. And we're going to have a talk today about this painting, Tank Woman. And here is William now. Um, this painting came from a series of paintings that I did by using a television in my studio. I don't watch television, I don't read newspapers, I don't like people telling me how to think or the, you know, what's on the news just bores me shitless. So what in actual fact happened was I decided that I would actually do paintings about what was on the world news. So I put the uh, television on 24 hour news, stuck it in the middle of my studio and started to do paintings from the news, right? That everybody was saying what an isolate I was. Anyway, the, uh, the, the strangest things happened when I was watching it. There was, a, a, there was a, an actual news broadcast of a phosphorus shell chasing a little kid through a schoolyard in Palestine. Horrific in, image. Uh, the people invite this stuff into their living room. It's just unbelievable. Anyway, I, it, it, it just shocked me. Uh, you know, I've been a teacher myself and having an affinity with kids and, and, and so on. It just seemed like it was just horrible to see somebody bombing a school. Um, they then switched to, to have an interview the, 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 the person who was bombing the school, which was unbelievable. And the interviewer got, suddenly this woman took off her, her helmet and she was the tank commander. And she had been firing the shells into this school. It, it, was, it just shocked me that, that in actual fact that oh, you would have a woman as a tank commander. <laughs> it, that, that was it. Anyway, so I did this painting from it. Now, how I did it was, this is very much influenced by Basquiat, who, who in many ways painted like a, ch a child. So I started... I used to paint tanks and aeroplanes when I was a kid. So I started to paint this tank here, right? Um, I then put the tank woman up in here, and I, I actually caricatured her, I made her larger than the tank. But most of the actual drawing is the way I used to do the, uh, drawings when I was a kid. So I used a scraper and, and I also wrote, the, the because it was a phosphorus shell that they fired into the school, um, I, I did that, I put the, the phosphorus in because I really like the idea of sort of using words. This is the Israeli sign. Uh, it's, uh, and as you can see, there's sort of odd things. This looks like a breast and a machine gun. And uh, down here, I started to use stars and little flags. All the kind of way a child would do in the fields down here. And, uh, and then I wrote Holy Land because I thought that was an anachronism. That, that in actual fact this stuff is going on in the holy land. Anyway, I find it one of my most uh, endearing paintings. I, I really love the Tang Woman and a lot of people like it. Uh, I'm, I've got a lot of... Uh, I, I wouldn't like to sell it, I really like it. It's, uh, it's one of my, I think, one of my most successful paintings coming from that. There we go. Do you want